Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to another episode of All Scoring No Defense, the best sports channel. And on this episode, I'm going to explain how the Los Angeles Dodgers were able to tie the series up 1-1 against the San Francisco Giants. Let's get into it. Okay, if you watched like I did on Saturday night, you saw the Los Angeles Dodgers put up nine runs against the San Francisco Giants. And in this game, you had to marvel at how the LA Dodgers came out and hit the baseball. Now, things got set or the hitting started at the top of the second. When starting pitcher Julio Igras, I, I apologize if I'm saying his name wrong, I really do. When Julio Igras hit a two-run RBI, that is what put the Los Angeles Dodgers on the scoreboard. And this was at the top of the second. Now, the San Francisco Giants would respond at the bottom of the second with a run one, with a one-run hit. But things wouldn't get intriguing until the sixth inning, sixth inning. That is when Cody Bellinger, that's when he showed us that MVP form. He hit a two-run RBI, and that is what set the Los Angeles Dodgers up for scoring position. Because in that sixth inning, the Dodgers scored four times. They scored four runs, and that is what ultimately set the game apart. Now, the Dodgers would end up later adding in three more scores, which we gave them nine. But you had to marvel how the LA Dodgers played. Also... Mookie Betts, Mookie Betts and Justin Turner's defense was amazing, especially Mookie Betts. Did you guys see that play where he caught the ball and then turned around and threw it perfectly? So he had that out in that sixth inning. That was amazing. And then their defense, and it's going to be very interesting to see how this game three goes because that's all for this episode. Thank you guys so much for listening. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. I do new episodes like this Monday through Friday, and I'm out.